This is going to be ours, and I think it's going to allow our students, our fans, our alums to really feel like they're at home. Georgia State University was granted approval to buy Turner Field late last year and began its construction in February of 2017. According to the AJC, the $26 million deal would go towards stadium renovations and remake Turner Field into a 22,000 seat stadium. It would take place in two phases, would include a new field covering upper deck seating, reorienting lower bowl seating, and upgrading locker rooms in other areas. The J.E. Dunn Construction Company has started transforming Turner Field into the new Georgia State Stadium. Take a look, you can already see the work that the construction workers are doing by removing the seats and transforming the old baseball field into a new football stadium. The stadium is off limits during construction. However, that has not stopped the members of United Students Against Sweatshops, or USAS, and the Turner Field Coalition from protesting right outside of the stadium. Protester. Ryan Flynn says that they do not plan on moving anytime soon. We've gained a lot of support since we've been here for this week um, and it's actually pretty great. I spoke with Mike Holmes, Associate Athletic Director, who gave Panther Report an exclusive tour of the stadium that is now undergoing construction. We're just excited about this time in Georgia State history. It's a, it's a transformational time, not only for athletics, but for the university. It is currently named the Georgia State Stadium but Georgia State is looking to sell the naming rights. Georgia State Stadium is expected to be finished by the end of July. I'm Michaela Newton for Panther Report.